Assertion, making a statement without evidence or proof. Bandwagon, believing or doing something because many others do. Beautiful people, associating beauty with success or credibility. Big lie, spreading a falsehood so colossal that people believe it must be true. Black and white fallacy, seeing situations as only two extreme options, ignoring alternatives. Card stacking, presenting only information that supports your argument while ignoring contrary evidence. Cherry picking, selectively choosing data or evidence to support your viewpoint. Circular reasoning, using your conclusion to support your premise, creating a loop. Cult of personality, idolizing a charismatic leader to an excessive degree. Disinformation, spreading false information deliberately to deceive others. Door in the face, making a large request knowing it will be refused, then following up with a smaller request. Downplaying, minimizing the significance of something. Euphemism, using a mild or indirect word or phrase instead of a harsh or direct one. Fear-mongering, using fear to influence opinions or actions. Flag-waving, associating oneself with patriotism or nationalism to gain support. Glittering generalities, using emotionally appealing words to evoke positive feelings without providing evidence. Guilt by association, holding someone accountable for the actions of others they are associated with. Half-truth, only telling part of the truth leaving out important details. Hyperbole, exaggerating or overstating something for emphasis or effect. Intentional vagueness, being deliberately unclear or ambiguous to avoid commitment or responsibility. Labeling, attaching a negative or positive label to a person or group to influence perception. Lesser of two evils, choosing the option perceived as less bad when neither choice is desirable. Loaded language, Using words with strong emotional connotations to sway opinions. Love bombing. Showering someone with excessive affection or attention to manipulate them. Lying by omission. Deliberately omitting relevant information to deceive. Manipulation of numbers. Presenting statistics in a biased or misleading way to support an argument. Name calling. Using derogatory or emotionally charged language to discredit someone. Oversimplification. Presenting a complex issue in an overly simple or superficial way. Plain folks. Portraying oneself as an ordinary person to gain trust or credibility. Polarization. Dividing people or opinions into extreme and opposing groups. Projection. Attributing one's own undesirable traits or feelings to others. Propaganda of the deed. Using actions instead of words to promote a political agenda. Psychological warfare. Using psychological tactics to undermine or manipulate an opponent. Scapegoating. Blaming a person or group for problems that are not entirely their fault. Scare tactics. Using fear to manipulate people into accepting a certain viewpoint or taking a specific action. Selective quoting. Quoting someone out of context to distort their intended meaning. Self-projection. Projecting one's own feelings or desires onto others. Slogan. A memorable phrase used in advertising or propaganda to convey a message. Snob. Appeal. Associating a product or idea with high status or exclusivity. Stereotyping. Making assumptions about a person or group based on oversimplified characteristics. Testimonial. Using endorsements from celebrities or authority figures to promote a product or idea. Thought terminating cliche. Using a simplistic phrase to dismiss complex thoughts or criticisms. Transfer. Associating a product, idea, or person with positive or negative attributes without providing evidence. Unstated assumption, assuming a premise without explicitly stating it. Virtue words, using words with positive connotations to evoke favorable emotions. Weasel words, using language that appears to make a claim while allowing for plausible deniability. Ad hominem, attacking the person making an argument rather than addressing the argument itself. Ad nauseum, repeating an argument or idea so often that it becomes tiresome or annoying. Appeal to authority. Using the opinion of an authority figure to validate an argument. Appeal to emotion. Manipulating emotions to persuade instead of using logical arguments. Appeal to fear. Using fear to persuade people to accept a certain viewpoint or take a specific action. Appeal to nature. Arguing that something is good or right because it is natural. Appeal to pity. Using pity or sympathy to persuade others to accept a claim or support an argument. Appeal to tradition. Arguing that something should be done a certain way because it's how it has always been done. Association fallacy. Linking a person, group, 
or idea with negative connotations to discredit them. Authority, bias, tending to believe authority figures or experts without questioning their opinions. Bait and switch, advertising a product or offer to attract customers, then substituting it with something less desirable. Blame game, assigning responsibility or fault to others instead of taking ownership. Bogus claims, making false or unverified statements. Bright future fallacy, assuming that future circumstances will be positive without considering potential risks or challenges. Buzzwords, using trendy or fashionable terms to impress or persuade. Common good, appealing to the well-being of society as a whole. Defamation, making false statements that harm someone's reputation. Dumbing down, simplifying information to the point of being patronizing or misleading. False attribution, incorrectly assigning a cause or source to something. Flattery, excessive or insincere praise to gain favor or influence. Gaslighting, manipulating someone into questioning their own perceptions, memories, or sanity. Generalization, making broad statements about a group or category based on limited or insufficient evidence. Historical revisionism, distorting or altering historical events or facts to fit a particular narrative or agenda. Jargon, using specialized language or terminology that is difficult for outsiders to understand. Justification by faith, believing in something without evidence or logical reasoning. Lesser evil, choosing a course of action that is considered less harmful or undesirable compared to available alternatives. Manufactured consent, controlling or manipulating public opinion through media and propaganda. Media bias, prejudice or partiality in news reporting or journalism. Minimization, downplaying or trivializing the significance of something. Misdirection, redirecting attention away from the real issue or problem. Name dropping, mentioning famous or influential people to bolster one's own credibility or status. Non sequitur, drawing a conclusion that does not logically follow from the premises. Oversimplification, presenting a complex issue or problem in a simplistic or superficial manner. Patriotic music, using music to evoke feelings of patriotism or national pride. Patriotic slogans, using slogans or catchphrases to promote national unity or allegiance. Poisoning the well, preemptively discrediting an opponent or argument to make it less persuasive. Psychological operations, using psychological tactics to influence or manipulate individuals or groups. Red herring, introducing irrelevant information to distract or divert attention from the main issue. Reductio ad Hitlerum, comparing someone or something to Hitler or the Nazis to discredit them. Subliminal messaging, hidden words or images that are not consciously perceived but may influence one's attitudes and behavior.